hey guys and welcome to this tutorial in today's video i'm going to show you how to render a transparent video in sony vegas if you are not already a subscriber to this channel please hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so that you won't miss anything let's get into the video <laughs> is a lower third that I recently created so we're gonna use this lower third to create this transparent background video but before we proceed make sure you don't place any useless object or image in the video since that is going to affect our rendering process at the end so for example if I go to media generators and I select solid color maybe I import this yellow color here you can see that this yellow background is gonna affect our transparent video rendering at the end so you don't need to place anything I'm gonna delete that make sure you deal just with what you will need to insert into your video like this lower third but be careful that doesn't mean that if you place this black solid background beneath you are lower third all is gonna be fine because the background was black no the background being black simply means that there is nothing beneath the created lower third so i'm going to show you just this first lower third my facebook lower third i won't include this other one since we need to save time to do that I just need to select this rendering zone like this one if you equally need some tips on how to set your video settings or how to render videos for YouTube purpose I'll put the link in the description so that you can go through go to file render as render as okay at this level you will need to select quicktime 7 i will put the link in the description you need to download and install quicktime 7 and take on 3 megabyte per second video go to customize template make sure you check include video go to the frame size and select high resolution or high definition 1920 by 1080p go to frame rate and select 29 fill order non-progressive scan is okay select non-progressive scan pixel aspect ratio 1 video format select animation or you select png that works perfectly well so I'll go to animation, but if you select PNG, that's going to work perfectly. Then go to the compressed depth, right click and go to 32 BPP curl. Make sure you set this to high, the quality to high, that is 100%. Keyframe, every frame, yes, check that, go to the audio part of it include audio this should be in case where there is a background sound in the lower third you want to create but if not you can uncheck that select the frame rate set it to 48 yes audio format music this one is okay bit depth 16 that is stereo make sure it is still the channel is stereo go to streaming but this one we don't need it so you can uncheck or as well you can allow it like that go to project video rendering quality use project setting go to best and the stereoscopic 3d mode select use project settings that is okay for that now you can go back to the first part make sure you save this one I will save it as transparent video rendering that's okay and hit on save template this 
is to facilitate your work whenever you want to do a transparent video rendering click on it and go to ok that is why you find the transparent video rendering appearing beneath so next time you want to do that you just need to go to quick time 7 and you select transparent video rendering without going to customize template anymore hit on render but before that make sure you select where you want to save your file like mine is save in this folder so go to render so i will be right back after the rendering process okay right now we are through with our video rendering go to open folder i will drop it here I don't need this one since there was some, an audio file in the video. Select this file and click on U and select the audio. So I'll place this one beneath. This way. Yeah, so this is the file, the video file that's going to prove that we seek a transparent video or rendering. So as you can see when I play it, this video doesn't show on our preview screen. So the technique I will show you right now is how you will need to remove this background. Right click on the video. Make sure you would scroll down and select properties. On the properties go to media and select alpha channel. It is set to none. Click and open the menu. Select straight on matter. Here on OK. As you can see, the video is now transparent. That is it. So that is how I create my transparent video in Vegas Pro. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to comment. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell so that you will be updated each time i upload a new video tutorial thank you for watching and see you in the next video